2 is a titan 1, the simplest beta lactam A beta lactam ring is a 4 membered lactam. A lactam is a cyclic amide, and beta lactams are named so because the nitrogen atom is attached to the beta carbon atom relative to the carbonyl. The simplest beta lactam possible is 2 is a titan 1. Beta lactams are significant structural units of medicines as manifested in many beta lactam antibiotics up to 1970. Most beta lactam research was concerned with the penicillin and cephalosporin groups. But since then, a wide variety of structures have been described. Penicillin core structure The beta lactam ring is part of the core structure of several antibiotic families, the principal ones being the penicillins, cephalosporins, carbapenems, and monobactams, which are, therefore, also called beta lactam antibiotics. Nearly all of these antibiotics work by inhibiting bacterial cell wall biosynthesis. This has a lethal effect on bacteria, although any given bacteria population will typically contain a subgroup that is resistant to beta lactam antibiotics. Bacterial resistance occurs as a result of the expression of one of many genes for the production of beta lactamases, a class of enzymes that break open the beta lactam ring. More than 1,800 different beta lactamase enzymes have been documented in various species of bacteria. These enzymes vary widely in their chemical structure and catalytic efficiencies. When bacterial populations have these resistant subgroups, treatment with beta-lactam can result in the resistant strain becoming more prevalent and therefore more virulent. Beta-lactam-derived antibiotics can be considered one of the most important antibiotic classes but prone to clinical resistance. Beta-lactam exhibits its antibiotic properties by imitating the naturally occurring d ala d ala substrate for the group of enzymes known as penicillin-binding proteins which have as function to cross-link the peptidoglycan part of the cell wall of the bacteria. The first synthetic beta-lactam was prepared by Hermann Staudinger in 1907 by reaction of the shift base of aniline and benzaldehyde with diphenocotine. In a 2 plus 2 cycloaddition, many methods have been developed for the synthesis of beta-lactams. The Breckpot beta-lactam synthesis produces substituted beta-lactams by the cyclization of beta-amino acid esters by use of a Grignard reagent. Mukiyama's reagent is also used in modified Breckpot synthesis. Due to ring strain, beta-lactams are more readily hydrolyzed than linear amides or larger lactams. This strain is further increased by fusion to a second ring, as found in most beta-lactam antibiotics. This trend is due to the amide character of the beta-lactam being reduced by the aplanarity of the system. The nitrogen atom of an ideal amide is sp2 hybridized due to resonance, and sp2 hybridized atoms have trigonal planar bond geometry. As a pyramidal bond geometry is forced upon the nitrogen atom by the ring strain, the resonance of the amide bond is reduced, and the carbonyl becomes more ketone-like. Nobel laureate Robert Burns Woodward described a parameter H as a measure of the height of the trigonal pyramid defined by the nitrogen and its three adjacent atoms. H corresponds to the strength of the beta-lactam bond with lower numbers being stronger and less reactive. Monobactams have H values between 0. 0.05 and 0. 0.10 angstroms. Cephams have H values in of 0. 20 to 0. 25 A ring. Panams have values in the range 0. 40 to 0. 50 A ring, while carbapenems and clavams have values of 0. 50 to 0. 60 A ring, being the most reactive of the beta lactams toward hydrolysis. Thanks for watching.